Yo, what's going on guys and peers? So, I wanted to take a little break from uh, Medium. I was playing on Medium. And I wanted to take a little break because uh, there's a lot of Zergs in the area was. And I wanted to do a solo series. So, I decided, hey, a lot of people like watching modded. They like watching modded cave raids. And I come online and I see a cave raid. Literally, first thing I see is a cave raid. So, we're going to go down there. We are, well, it wasn't a cave raid, it was a cave. We're going to go down there. Um, we're going to do the disconnect uh, glitch thing. Um, I actually have, I actually have the turret down there. Um, I went down there and the turret was off. The kids are literally dumb. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to play the clip right now for you guys. <laughs> As you can see, they literally left the turn off and stuff, and I literally made a base right outside of uh, of their cave. So we're gonna go outside. We have everything we need. We have nine rockets and a good amount of ammo. We're gonna shoot out that um, that thing silently, the front window silently, and uh, we're gonna go from there. I think it'll be pretty easy. We'll have enough ammo for that, and we'll have enough ammo to hit some doors. I think so. Let's go ahead and go while people are going to get distracted with those booms. Um, okay, so we're going to be doing the disconnect glitch is when you bind a key to disconnect. So when you get down there, you don't die. I'm pretty sure you guys have seen a lot of those videos or people doing them or maybe you've done it yourself. Um, so yeah, we go right down here. We have the auto turret as you guys uh, remember from watching the video. So we come down here and right there we press the button. And then there's a bag there. It looks like someone actually died. Oh my god, I can't wait to see what what happened there. And then we'll reconnect. All right, boys, we are back in. Ooh. And whoa, we got wounded. What? Okay, we'll try this again. It's fine. It's fine. Actually, we'll see if we stand up. Let's see if we stand up here. Right, we're here on the last disconnect. We had to do so many disconnects here, but um oh, this is my old body. That's right here. And then wait what oh oh my god that was so lucky it was like under the ground oh my god i am so glad that thing actually worked through like oh that is so lucky guys you do not understand and oh look another another freaking laptop these are actually pretty rare on here all right so here's what we're gonna do let our inventory is somewhat fixed up here um this is what my plan was, right? I was going to go through that door after I go through this one right here. Um, it takes 300 bullets to take out the window. Then we jump over the window. Uh, we jump into the window and stuff. We had this auto turn protecting us. Uh, I was going to turn it around after we are in. Um, but, yeah, I mean, it should work. I might actually leave it like this. I'm going to leave it like this, actually. So if they come online or if they are online, uh, who knows? So... Let's go ahead and uh, start drilling um, right through right through this precious little thing right here. All right, here we go. And uh, we're about to be through this thing. I'm thinking I'm going to take down one door with explosive ammo. And then after I take down the door, I'm gonna start rocking through the other doors because we have enough explosive ammo here to take down a door. So we might as well take down this door right here and then we'll uh, start rocketing through the other doors. So let's do that. Right, guys, I was splashing the auto turret as well while I was doing that. So the auto turret is now dead. Our protection is now dead. Great. Um, I'm trying to see if I can listen if there's any other 
auto turrets behind this door, but I don't hear anything, so I think we're not going to be attacked by an auto turret. Oh, we're not? Okay. I see... I see doors. Um... <gasps> Holy crap. Okay, guys. Despacito. TC, what? what the heck? We're in TC. Literally one door in, and we're in TC. We, we literally have TC already. That's it. Like, the raid, the raid is literally over, guys. This base is literally mine. Just like that, this base is literally mine. Just like that, this base is mine. And they had a Luffing Case Sulfur. I haven't, I don't have to use any more explosive on this base. Luffing Case Sulfur, and I have so many mats that I can make a base with. Because I have a couple mats at the base and stuff. I don't know if you guys saw it in the TC. But, not this many mats. You know what I mean? Like, it's not this good. Dean, I might actually keep the cave base and actually make it, like, good. Alright, now, they have a lot of charcoal as well, which is something I was really low on. So, thanks for that. What's back here? Can they hide any stashes back here by any chance? I don't think so. But, now we have TC. I'm, uh, let me make a, a code lock, actually. Oh my god, dude. I love raiding. Like, I don't know. I just love this feeling. Clear off, off, lock, TC. Um, honestly, guys, we don't have to waste any more booms. All we, we could do now is, uh, I think we need a hammer for this, though. We can start doing slash remove on everything. Um, but it is going to take, we're in a raid zone. So in 8 minutes and 24 seconds, I'm going to put the timer on my phone. We're going to be coming back here and we're going to go ahead all right eight minutes and we're going to come go ahead and come back here and we're going to be able to go ahead and just literally remove everything in this base and go through it for free guys i cannot wait and our door is already being repaired oh man dude this is insane i'm probably gonna put another door right here just to be safe make sure we're secured while we wait for this but guys, this is actually such a good raid. You have no idea how happy I am. TC was literally right here. It didn't even have a door on it, man. Didn't even have a door on it. How dumb can you be? All right, I'll see you guys in eight minutes. So we're back. Um, <laughs> now I think it is time we sash and move this guy's base. Ooh, he likes to wall in loot. Look at him. He likes to wall in all his loot. Oh, wow. Okay. Now, where does he hide it is the question. He has to have it in here somewhere. Oh, there's his loot. Right up there is his loot. Luckily, I brought a beautiful, beautiful ladder. Oh, my God. It's wide open. Chairman Mo. Bob, these are the bot squads. Okay, let's see how much loot. AK set, empty, empty. All right, it's all bullshit, bullshit. Oh, components. Okay, a good amount of mats right here. Some more guns. We didn't even, we didn't have any AKs back at the base. Like we had no components or anything back at the base. Armor. Um. Oh, more guns and armor and stuff that we needed. Um. That was bullshit. More armor. Um, ooh, a lot of LR, okay, AK, AK, another AK, a bolty, alright, some good guns here, why is this wood, okay, we'll, we'll investigate that later, um, under here, nothing, um, what does he have on him, 17 explosives, hello, you're dead, um, what does he have on him, just some AKs and stuff, and all the stuff he used to block himself in, um, laser sight, all this is bullshit. So I think we got all of their booms. We got, yeah, I think we got all of their booms, um, for the most part. Whoa, I didn't know you can do that. You could fit two small boxes. We got most of their booms, and we just have a whole bunch of guns and stuff now to transfer. Um, a lot of component, a lot of components and mats. Actually, not even that much components. I mean, at all. He didn't really have... Oh, he had 187 explosive ammo on him as well. I mean, he wasn't really that loaded, but... I mean, I'm not complaining. I'm going to take it, you know? <laughs> um, here are the beds. Cave, cave, cave. Um, armor double door and cold locks just blurging all over the place. I think we got everything. Um, I'll slash remove some more. 
And I'll just make sure that we got every last bit of loot and these scumbags are not having any bit of it. All right, yeah, it's all empty. This is just the entrance point at this point. Um, let's go ahead and close that so we don't get <laughs> we don't get raided by some guys while we're literally in here raiding these guys. So, um, yeah, I mean, for the most part, these guys. <laughs> I don't even know what to, I don't even know what to say about them. Like, they had a really scummy base. Okay, we'll say that they had a scummy base. And we destroyed them. We took all their stuff, and it was fun. I enjoyed every bit of it. Um, that's pretty much it. <laughs> I mean, I had fun writing them. Now, I'm probably gonna go ahead and move all this stuff to the base. I do want to keep this cave, though. I was thinking about just completely wiping this cave and making it my own. I might just do that instead. And actually making it uh, work a while. And no, nah, that's not as fun as actually. It's not, yeah, it's not as fun. I'll actually just. I'll just move all this stuff over to the base and I'll just make a different type of base. So, yep. Alright, let's move everything we just got over to the base. And, uh, yeah, I mean, I'm pretty sure we made profit. <laughs> I'm not pretty sure. I know we made profit. We literally wasted like. Almost no sulfur, and we got 17 of these, and we got some of that. So we can make two more rockets when we get home, and then make a whole bunch more explosive ammo. We can hit a couple more bases, and uh, yeah. So let's go ahead and do that.